in an unforeseen development NASA has redirected its attention to Venus. Spurred by the recent discovery of potential life signs, a review of NASA's archives from the 1960s reveals that Venus was once considered a hostile planet while Mars was seen as the future of humanity. This perception was common. During the Great Space Race, the Soviet Union focused its efforts on Venus, despite its seemingly unwelcoming environment and this dedication continued until the USS STS collapse. Thanks to astrophysicist Neil deGrasse Tyson, we now have deeper insights into these missions. Join us as we delve into the Soviet missions to Venus revealing declassified images and forgotten histories. The dissolution of the Soviet Union changed global diplomatic relations and exposed many secrets, including those of its space program. The USSR was known for its secrecy from advanced surveillance to possible encounters with extraterrestrial life. Surprisingly, before the USA took the lead in planetary exploration, the Soviet Union was at the forefront particularly, with a focus on Venus from 1961 to 1983. The Venera missions, as they were known, in Russian differed from America's lunar missions while the USA concentrated on the moon, the Soviets saw Venus as a crucial goal despite the harsh conditions on Venus. The USSR sent 28 spacecraft to the planet with 13 entering its atmosphere and at successfully landing these missions achieved significant successes though. They remained relatively obscure due to Soviet secrecy in 1992 after the Soviet Union's collapse, the space agency was renamed Rose Cosmos and much historical. Data was lost, nevertheless, Soviet. Exploration of Venus provided valuable insights into the planet's extreme climate. Today, many researchers debate whether Venus can support life due to its high temperatures and thick atmosphere, yet the Soviet missions laid the foundation for understanding these. Conditions the USSR's focus on Venus was likely driven by cost-efficiency Venus. At an average distance of 40 million, kiln from Earth is much closer than Mars, which is about 250 million kiln away. This proximity made Venus a more feasible target for the Soviets who had fewer resources compared to the wealthier USA additionally Soviet. Rockets FA Technical CH Challenges making shorter, more practical missions, more achievable the context of the space. Race is essential to understanding the Van Era missions in 1957 the USSR. Launched Sputnik 1 the first artificial satellite igniting intense competition with the USA while NASA struggled with early Venus missions the USSR. Capitalized on these setbacks the Soviets aimed to accomplish what NASA could not asserting their dominance. Despite limited resources and internal challenges, American media often portrayed Venus negatively while Mars was seen as humanity's destiny. However, the Soviets remained steadfast there. Van Era missions aligned with the Cold War demonstrated their ability to innovate effectively despite early failures. The USSR achieved significant milestones such as the first probe to enter another planet's atmosphere and transmit images and sounds from Venus by 1966 Van Era 3 became the first probe to land on Venus intensifying the space race the 1970s saw further progress with the USSR launching increasingly advanced spacecraft Van Era 9 launched in 1975 provided the first high resolution Images of Venus's surface This achievement was followed by Van Era 10, which delivered the first color. Photographs the pinnacle of these efforts came with Van Era 13 in 1981, which returned advanced color images and record ed sounds from Venus collectively. These missions expanded our knowledge of Venus despite the Soviet Union's eventual collapse much of what we know. About Venus originates from these pioneering missions the space race saw. 
the USA and USSR pursuing different paths driven by distinct strategic and philosophical motives for the Soviets. Venus was a challenging yet achievable target while the USA focused on lunar landings to showcase technological prowess despite technical difficulties. The Venera missions offered crucial insights into Venus' influencing future. Planetary exploration, the legacy of the Venera missions persists underscoring the Soviet Union's scientific ambitions and contributions to global knowledge. These missions expanded our understanding of Venus and paved the way for future studies as new missions to Venus are planned. The lessons from the Venera program continue to guide and inspire looking back both superpowers achieved impressive milestones each, leaving a lasting impact on space. Exploration, the rivalry between them, spurred rapid advancements in technology and engineering preparing future generations of space explorers as we plan new missions to Venus. The challenging efforts of the Soviet Venera program remind us of humanity's relentless pursuit of knowledge and our unyielding spirit of exploration in the cosmos, the legacy of the Venera missions, stands as proof of the IET Union, scientific expertise and determination. During the space race, these missions not only provided a wealth of data about Venus, but also showcased the USSR's ability to overcome significant technological challenges. The Venera program set a high bar for planetary exploration with each mission building on the successes and lessons learned from its predecessors beyond scientific achievements. The Venera missions also had geopolitical significance. The success of these missions bolstered the USSR's position as a major player in space exploration, highlighting the technological and scientific capabilities of the Soviet Union during a time of intense rivalry with the United States, the Van Era program underscored the USSR's commitment to space exploration even when faced with economic and political obstacles as we move forward the data from the Van Era. Missions remains invaluable, for example. The insights from the Van Era 9 and 13 missions have enhanced our understanding of Venus's atmospheric composition surface conditions and geological features this foundational knowledge has influenced subsequent missions and studies providing a baseline for comparisons with other planetary bodies. The renewed interest in Venus in recent years with missions from NASA ESA and other space agencies reflects the ongoing importance of the Venera program's contributions these new Missions aim to build on the groundwork established by the Van Era spacecraft, seeking to unra the mysteries of Venus's past, present, and potential for habitability. Furthermore, the success of the Van Era missions has inspired a new generation of scientists and engineers. The innovative technologies and methods developed for the Van Era program continue to shape space exploration. Techniques from atmospheric entry, systems to remote sensing instruments, the spirit of exploration and scientific curiosity that drove the Van Era missions remains a motivating force in contemporary space exploration efforts. Reflecting on the Van Era program, we recognize not only the technical and scientific milestones achieved, but also the broader impact on global space. Exploration, the competition between the USA and the USSR spurred unprecedented advancements in technology and knowledge. As we advance into the future of space, exploration, the legacy of the Van Era, missions serves as a reminder of humanity's capacity for innovation and discovery in conclusion, the Van Era. Missions were a remarkable achievement in space exploration history. They provided essential insights into one of our solar system's most enigmatic planets and demonstrated the Soviet Union's remarkable capabilities in space science. As we continue exploring Venus and other 
celestial bodies, the lessons learned from the Van Era program will remain a crucial part of our journey into the cosmos, inspiring future generations to push the boundaries of exploration and understanding to continue exploring Venus and expand on the historical and scientific context of the Van Era. Missions we delve deeper into the legacy of Soviet space exploration and its impact on modern space science. The Van Era program was more than just a series of missions. It represented a bold vision and ambition that reflected the Soviet Union's broader strategic goals. During the Cold War, the USSR's focus on Venus was a calculated decision driven by both scientific curiosity and geopolitical strategy while Venus with its harsh conditions might seem an unconventional target it symbolized. Soviet perseverance and innovation in space technology, one of the key aspects of the Van Era missions was their emphasis on atmospheric studies. Venus has an extraordinarily thick atmosphere composed mainly of carbon dioxide with clouds of sulfuric acid. This atmosphere creates a runaway greenhouse effect, leading to surface temperatures that can exceed 460 degrees Celsius, 860 degrees Fahrenheit. By examining Venus's atmosphere, Soviet scientists aimed to gain insights into planetary atmospheres in general, including those of Earth and other planets. These insights have been crucial for understanding the impacts of greenhouse gases and climate change on our own planet, the technological advancements of the Van Era program were remarkable. For instance, the design of the Van Era spacecraft had to accommodate extreme temperatures and pressures to withstand these conditions. The spacecraft were equipped with specially engineered heat shields and protective casings. The success of these technological innovations not only advanced Soviet space capabilities but also provided valuable lessons for future missions to other hostile environments in addition to its scientific goals. The Van Era program served as a showcase of Soviet technological prowess during the peak of the Cold War demonstrating advanced technology was a key aspect of proving national strength the successful deployment and operation of Van Era. Spacecraft were intended to highlight the Soviet Union's ability to achieve major scientific and technological milestones even amid significant challenges. Another notable aspect of the Van Era missions was their impact on international space diplomacy. The early successes of the Van Era program were closely observed by space agencies. Worldwide, the USSR's accomplishments prompted other nations, including the United States and members of the European Space Agency to escalate their own space exploration efforts. This competitive atmosphere drove rapid advancements in technology and scientific knowledge on a global scale. Despite the intense rivalry, the Venera missions also encouraged a sense of shared scientific endeavor, the exchange of data and insights among international scientists even during periods of heightened political tension demonstrated the universal appeal of space exploration. For instance, data from the Van Era missions have been utilized by scientists globally to refine models of atmospheric physics and planetary geology. This collaborative aspect of space science highlights how exploration Efforts, regardless of national origin, contribute to a collective understanding of the cosmos as we reflect on the Van Era missions. It is also important to acknowledge the contributions of individual scientists and engineers who made these achievements possible figures, such as Sergei Korol, often referred to as the chief designer of the Soviet space program, played a pivotal role in shaping the direction of space. Exploration Coral's leadership and vision were crucial in the success of the Van Era program and other landmark Soviet space missions. The Van Era missions also paved the way for future 
exploration of Venus and other planets, the knowledge gained from these missions has been instrumental in designing subsequent space probes and missions for example the data from Venera 9 and 13 helped guide the development of NASA's Mellon spacecraft which mapped the surface of Venus using radar the legacy of the Vera program can be seen in the ongoing interest in Venus with new missions planned by NASA the European Space Agency and other space agencies looking ahead the renewed interest in Venus is driven by the desire to understand the planet's history and its potential for habitability recent. Studies suggest that Venus may have once had liquid water on its surface raising, intriguing questions about its past, climate and potential for life. The Venera missions provided crucial baseline data which modern missions are now building upon to explore these possibilities further the technological innovations developed for the Venera program also continue to influence space exploration techniques for instance the development of robust heat shields and high temperature materials for the Venera missions has had applications beyond planetary exploration these technologies have been adapted for use in other high temperature environments such as spacecraft reentry systems and industrial processes in summary the the Venera missions were a groundbreaking series of space missions that advanced our understanding of Venus and demonstrated the Soviet Union's technological capabilities they represented a significant achievement in the history of space exploration providing valuable insights into planetary atmospheres and paving the way for future missions the legacy of the Venera program endures in the form of continued scientific research technological innovations and international collaboration as we continue to explore the cosmos the lessons learned from the Venera missions will remain an integral part of our journey inspiring future generations to push the boundaries of exploration and understanding the impact of the Venera missions extends beyond scientific and technological achievements they also played a role in shaping our cultural and intellectual perceptions of space exploration the images and data returned by the Venera spacecraft offered a glimpse into the alien world of Venus capturing the imagination of people around the globe this sense of wonder and curiosity about the unknown is a fundamental aspect of human exploration and discovery. Moreover, the Venera missions highlighted the importance of perseverance and resilience in the face of challenges. The harsh conditions of Venus presented significant obstacles, but the Soviet space program's determination to succeed drove the development of innovative solutions this spirit of perseverance is a valuable lesson for all fields of scientific and technological endeavor reminding us that progress often requires overcoming significant obstacles the story of the Venera missions also reflects the broader context of space exploration as a collaborative and competitive enterprise while the Cold War rivalry between the USA and USSR spurred technological advancements. It also fostered a spirit of global cooperation in the scientific community. The exchange of knowledge and collaboration across borders has been essential for advancing our understanding of the universe. In conclusion, the Venera missions were a remarkable chapter in the history of space exploration. They provided crucial insights into Venus demonstrated the Soviet Union's technological prowess and inspired future generations of scientists and engineers as we look to the future the legacy of the Venera program serves as a reminder of humanity's capacity for innovation curiosity and exploration the lessons learned from these pioneering missions will continue to shape our understanding of the cosmos and drive future exploration efforts.